Hey, what's happening, you one? Sir James coming at you guys with another video. And in today's video, I'm here to give you guys a unboxing of what's in this large box. Now, this arrived today in the mail, and this actually came from a company from Game DS. Now, if you guys have recalled the channel update that I did, where in that video I was discussing um, all the different items I was going to be picking up up until mid November, I stated that uh, besides some upcoming product reviews, that the company known as Game DS was also sending me a couple products to review as well. However, before I open this box, I do want to question FedEx because who was trying to get into my package? I mean, it's open on this side, open on this side, and cut up up into this midpoint here. So FedEx, I'm watching you. This is why I don't like, well, when I order stuff, I don't like ordering things because you never know who's going to try to steal your packages. But anyways, here's the box right here. So let me go ahead and open this up, even though it's already halfway opened. Um, but anyways, good thing there is that tape right here in the center. I see a lot of bubble wrap. I almost feel like I'm an unboxing like a statue of some kind. So look how protected it is. Crazy. Okay, so we have two items in the box. Well, it's actually heavier than I thought. So here is a mouse. Put that to the side. And we have a keyboard. Go ahead. There, we don't need that box anymore. So let's go ahead and start with the keyboard. Again, this is just a quick unboxing kind of showcase. So this is the uh, Hermes plus the Erebasi. I'm not sure how that's pronounced over there. So that. So this is basically kind of a two-in-one where this includes a mechanical keyboard and you also get a mouse, uh, play micro, uh, responsive lighting, Hera software, and of course the mouse has a 4000 DPI with precision aim button and has a lot of information on the back. So there is the box right there. So let's go ahead and open this up, take a quick look. And of course for my product reviews on these I have about a couple weeks per item here to review for you guys. Uh, I may do the mouse first because that's the one I'm really interested in. So the first box, this is again the keyboard and mouse combo. So we have the mouse right here. Um, comfortable in terms of design, very uh, you know clicky and stuff like that. So uh, that is what the mouse looks like. It is a corded mouse, so just a standard cord, not uh, you know the braided cables or anything like that. Overall, really feels comfortable. In the terms of the hands, I'm trying to figure out where the precision shot button is at. I don't see it, but maybe there's something else to this. So there is that. And then, got some paperwork here. It even comes with one of those little key things. So if you want to remove the keys, makes it easier for when you're doing a deeper cleaning. Okay, put this box to the side. I know it may seem like I'm trying to rush because I'm trying to get back to playing Destiny Rise of Iron. Uh, but um, yeah, so this one also has a standard cable. It's not braided uh, right here and it's not gold plated at the end. Uh, but here is the keyboard. Wait, is this really a mechanical keyboard? Nah. For real? I'm questioning that because the keys as I'm pressing them, aren't like clicky clicky, like razor click. I'm not sure if you can hear it from here. So yeah, these aren't like clicky clicky keys. So that's kind of weird. But overall it has a nice slim design to it. Over there, I'm not sure what, the, uh, what light up features it will have. Again, I'll have to check that out when I'm using this product for my review purposes. Uh, you have the feet on the back. There's even a cable management back here as well. So you kind of manage this and kind of go whatever direction you want to go for. So in this case, you know, again, as an example right there. So that is the mouse and keyboard or one of the mouses, I should say. Put that there. Yeah, and the keys are removable. So here is the mouse. This one is interesting. So this is the uh, Zeus Esports Edition Laser Gaming Mouse. This is a, oh, it says it right here, professional 
FPS and MMO gaming kits, and uh, just a few other information. Accessories and storage pouch? What? Pretty cool. But there's all that. If you guys want to pause and read that, or I've just put a link in the description down below if you guys want to check out the products yourself or list it on their site, which that information is below too. So that is all of the tape. Okay, so it has like all the information listed inside here too. But you are presented with basically like a window box for your mouse, so that's always nice. Let's see. So how do we, oh, there's more tape. Of course, more tape. Don't you like it when you're excited for an item and you just want to get to using it, but you can't get to it because they just want to like seal up the package so you can't? Okay. Try not to, ooh, almost dropped something there. So you got a little paper thing here. Uh, ooh, there's some weight to this thing. Okay, hold on. Okay, so another box. I mean, there's just a lot of a box within a box. So here we have, looks like interchangeable accessories. Again, this is starting to remind me of that was it the Rat 7 mouse that I did about, I think back in 2013, that customizable mouse? But you have different uh, things here. It looks like these are for like the sides. Pretty cool, and there's some weird rubber thing here. I'm not sure exactly what that's for. Um, what else we have here? Um, looks like some skin. Uh, what is this? Let's go ahead and check this out. I mean, this is barely new to me, so. Uh, or I think these are like grips or something like that. There's like these little sticker things here. So I'm gonna have to figure out what that's for. And I believe this is a pouch right here. So yeah, this is a, a pouch for your accessories. So there you go. I thought that was like a pouch for the mouse, but this is a pouch for your accessories. And I think this tells you what it is right here. That's just the installation guide. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna have to figure all that out. Again, this is just kind of showcasing the items really quick. And then we have the mouse here, which is hooked on to these freaking straps. Come on now. <laughs> now these are attached. There you go. So besides the tape, you also have it like securely fastened in this box. And it's like, I just want access to the mouse. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna have to. Okay, I can't rip that. So, I don't know. Oh, there we go. I think I got it now. Oh my gosh. Okay. So far, my only complaint is with the packaging. I get they want to secure the item as best as they can, but I don't think you need to secure it that much, just my honest opinion. Here is the mouse, finally. So. Pretty big mouse. Again, there's a lot of interchangeable parts here, so I think you could change the overall size of this. But just let me get a feel for the default setting here. Um, overall, it's not too bad. I may need to change this side right here because I'm having a weird, just a weird feeling just on this side. So that's something I'm gonna have to change. And what's cool is that apparently there's really no tools that are necessary. Uh, what is this? Oh, oh, there's the weight system right there. So this actually does have weights. So if you like um, a weight system there. So that's easy. And there's a lot of different buttons here. There's about three different buttons right here in the center. Uh, there's about one, two, three, four on the side. Plus this one, this would be like the precision shot or DPI, something like that. This is in fact on a braided cable too, by the way. And it is actually gold plated on the very end. So uh, this one actually is braided with gold plating. And apparently, how does this work? Oh, okay, so right here on the bottom, there's a lot of these little uh, things here, uh, little turntables or whatever. And basically you keep spinning this around and this will adjust the overall length of the side platings too for both the uh, left and right hand side. So that's pretty interesting, but again, these are from GameDS. I'll have a link if you guys wanna check out these products on the website. But again, I will have product reviews on these. These were sent to me free of charge, 
and I am not being paid to sponsor these at all. But again, that's just kind of a quick look. But if you guys have any questions, let me know in the comment section down below, and I'll see you guys next time.